Queen Charlotte A. Bridgerton Stories 2 Timelines gave the Bridgerton spin-off a chance to focus on its main characters in their youth and adulthood, with one storyline already hinting at its potential exploration in Bridgerton Season 3. Although addressing the beginning of Queen Charlotte and King George's romance, Queen Charlotte took just as much care in expanding on Agatha Danbury and Violet Bridgerton's backgrounds. Queen Charlotte, Lady Danbury, and Dowager Viscountess Bridgerton's efforts to pair people up on the marriage mart were already highlighted in Bridgerton seasons 1 and 2, but Queen Charlotte made the focus on the three women and the relationships linking them central to the spin-off story. Agatha Danbury and Violet Bridgerton's friendship became even more foggy after Queen Charlotte made Lord Ledger Agatha's lover. This was especially true if Violet deduced that Agatha and her father once had a romantic relationship. However, Agatha and Violet's conversations in the later timeline amply demonstrated how significant their friendship was to both of them. In fact, Agatha and Violet's Garden in Bloom discussion in Queen Charlotte Episode 5 not only cemented their friendship versus the weak acquaintances typically pursued within the ton, but also gave a hint at a future, exciting plot involving Violet in Bridgerton Season 3. Queen Charlotte sets up a new romance for Violet in Bridgerton Season 3, the Dowager Viscountess Bridgerton revealed a different side to Agatha Danbury and the viewers in Queen Charlotte episode 5 with her garden in bloom statement. In both the Netflix series and the original material in Julia Quinn's books, the Bridgerton matriarch was previously only depicted as a maternal character, whose potential for sexual love perished with her late husband Edmund. The most thrilling side story of Bridgerton season 3 would involve Violet's potential romance or perhaps just the pursuit of an affair, after she opened up to Agatha in Queen Charlotte Episode 5. Unlike Julia Quinn's books, which focused on one Bridgerton sibling at a time without offering side plots much focus, Netflix's Bridgerton brought various storylines forward in each season. A Violet romance could happen in Bridgerton Season 3, along with Colin and Penelope's romance, especially considering that their engagement and marriage brought much chaos within the ton, coinciding with the revelation of Penelope being behind Lady Whistledown in the books. A Violet Bridgerton love story could give her some time devoid of Bridgerton drama, while simultaneously painting a more complete picture of the character, one that isn't just a mother figure, and for whom love isn't just in her past. Sentence. Marriage offers so much companionship, tradition, family. Will Violet ever remarry in Bridgerton? Violet never got remarried in the books. However, Bridgerton had the option to go a different route. Edmund was constantly present in the Bridgerton books, thanks to Violet's lessons to her sons and daughters about genuine love, making it nearly hard to even consider dating someone else. Given how Queen Charlotte's Agatha story emphasized the liberties connected to widowhood, Violet giving them up to pursue a marriage would seem improbable especially given that she has six further children whose marriages she must worry about. Bridgerton might still evaluate Violet's options for romance, even if a second marriage wasn't in the cards for her, particularly in light of the setup Queen Charlotte.